Hallelujah, hallelujah. Rise up on your feet with me this morning. Let us thank the Lord. The Bible says that we should be anxious, worried for nothing. But in everything, with prayer and with supplication, we should thank the Lord for all he has done. And his peace will guard our hearts. Amen. So we're going to call upon his name this morning and we're going to tell him we thank him. Tell him we worship him. Tell him that we will not give ourselves to anxiety, but we'll give ourselves to prayer. We'll give ourselves to worship. We'll give ourselves to praise. Open your mouth and begin to praise his name this morning. Open your mouth and begin to worship him this morning. Tell him he is king and he is Lord over every aspect of your life. You are my refuge. You are my strength, I declare this morning. You are a sure help in time of trouble. The Bible says, if you call upon the name of the Lord, you shall be saved. Tolobo shekabaya, rekaba hande reba sekete, raba shanta leboro, zaba kate liba kada, rekos kabarande, resol to libra hande, lebra kaba sekete, raba shande lebo shikata, azekete iba kadoka. We give you praise this morning, rekaba shato lua, azoto liya bahetelea, azakande reba hando, rebo shiba kanda raba. Resete kete ya, aba sekete, riba shata la baye, rakodo bo shekaya, azente le bayara, zebra kada ba shekete le, reko bahanta le ba sete, razanta liya ba shekete, azonta liya ba sekete, aba shekete, riba kadosko, riya kada ba, eko bahande riba shanda, resete liba kada, open your mouth this morning, give him your praise. Give him your worship. Reko Satalea and Deleba Sekata Rabahando Shiba Rakata Resekete Rabahando Zebelekete Rakodobo Shebalada Asante Lia Basekete and Deleba Sekata Lababa Azosko Barande Lekos Kabarada Ekedebe. Every day comes with his own mercy. He says, cast your burden upon me. He calls and I will give you rest. I will sustain you. Reba hando shepeka. Raba soltalia. Andele boshki barada. Cast your burden upon the Lord this morning. Cast your burdens upon the Lord this morning. He says, take my yoke. For it is light. Eko shabayala. Asante lebra kando sebalala. Ateke teke ya. Eko shkabara. Maleke de boshkiyala. Aze kadada seyaba. La kondo shibra kando. Le sete sese. Tell him he is God and King. He is Lord over your life. Raba sete le de. Ako basha baranara. Le kede de si barada. There is no one like you, O God. In all the earth, there is none like you. Make out of heaven and earth. Say, Mahadosh, Kelebara, and Delebre Kete Mamaba, Escobarada, Ekete, Lacos Cabara, Ecos Cabale, Esetea, Alos Cabara, De Lecoba, Abran Telebe, Zibra Cabando Shibarada, La Sete, Acoba, Daliaba, Sekete, Azos Cabande Lebara. Open your mouth and declare over your day. Declare over the morning. Ese le kabada, ekosh kabara ne, rekete balara, azeke ne si barado, zabale de kaya, azos kabande, ekosh kabara, eke le ba shatana, ando se barada, eke te azos kabara. Build your most holy faith. Build your most holy faith. Azeka rabasonto, riba shatana. 
Open your mouth. Shame the enemy this morning. Tell the enemy you have made it to another day. Rakoda Bahati. Zabra Kando Shibalada. Ekos Kabalada. Asante Sebalado Koa. Ekos Kabalada. Eketea. Eketea. Alos Kabaye. Iko Bahata. Rebesete. Rakoda Banda. Rebesete. Ekos Kabalada. The Lord is your strength. The Lord is your strength. Declare this morning, Oh God, you are my strength. You are my strong tower. I will trust in you. Who can save like you do? Who can deliver like you do? Go before me today, O Lord, and make every crooked path straight. Go before me, O God, and cover every hole that the enemy has dug for me. Reba sata, and the rebo shikata. Maribo shata, rakata lekete, riba shando lobaya, azekete libarada. O God, assign your angels, assign the heavenly host over my life, over my children. Over my job, let them take charge, take hold of me, let them bear me Le in every way of mine, in all my ways, oh God, let them bear me today. Lekea, as a brakando, liba shata lebono, as a hande liba shata, e kasa baledea, e sota la baba, o ko shabalada, e kelea, e kelea. Do not be afraid, says the Lord. Put your trust in him, for he has not given us the spirit of fear. Declare it this morning. If the Lord has been good to you, if the Lord has sustained you, if the Lord has been faithful to you, you will lift your voice, you will worship, you will thank him. For you are God and God alone. In Jesus' name we pray. Put your hands together as we call and read them voices. We love you because you first loved us and you gave yourself for us and this morning we are here to give you back our lives thank you father i want to be more like you I want to be more like you I want to be the vessel you work through I want to be more like you <laughs> let that be your song this morning I want to be more 
like you Jesus I want to be more like you oh I want to be the vessel you work through I want to be more like you sing it again oh I want to be more like you Jesus I want to be more like you Lord I want to be the vessel you went through I want to be more like you say I want to be I want to be the vessel you work through I want to be more like you oh I want to be the vessel you work through I want to be more like you Oh, be lifted above all other gods. We lay our crown and worship you. Oh, be lifted above all other gods. We our crown and worship you for oh glorious God we praise your name we lay our crown and worship you oh glorious God we praise your name Lord we lay our crown and worship you come on worship him oh glorious God we praise your name we lay our crown and worship you say oh be lifted oh be lifted above all other gods we lay our crown and worship you oh be lifted of all other gods we lay our crown and worship you say oh glorious God we praise your name we lay our crown and worship Oh, glorious God, we praise your name. Lord, we lay, we lay our crown and worship you. We lay our crown and worship you. Father, we lay, we lay our crown and worship you. Yeshua, when I call you, you will answer. Yeshua, when I call you, you deliver. There's no name, 
no name greater than yours father there's no name no name greater than yours we call you Yeshua when we call you you will answer Yeshua when we call you you deliver there's no name no name greater than yours yeah <laughs> father there's no name no name greater than yours there's no name there's no name hey there's no name greater than yours yeah sure that's your name when we call you, you will answer. Yeshua. When we call you, you deliver. There's no name. Ha! There's no name greater than yours. There's no name. No name greater than yours. Oh, there's no name, no name greater than yours. Father, there's no name, ha, no name greater than yours. Let's stay right there. There's no name, ha, no name greater than yours. There's no name. No name greater than yours. That's why we call him Yeshua. When we call you, you will answer. Yeshua. When we call you, you deliver. Yeshua. When we call you, you will answer. Yeshua. When we call you, you deliver. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. To you belong all power, Jesus. Whenever I call your name, you make a way. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. To you belong all power, Jesus. Whenever I call your name, you made a way. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. <laughs> your name is a way maker, Jesus. To you belong all power, Jesus. Whenever I call your name, you made a way. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. When we call on the name of Jesus, he will come and make a way. When we call on the name of Jesus, every knee, every knee must bow. Your name, your name, your name is a strong tower, Jesus. 
to you belong all power Jesus whenever I call your name you made a way your name is a strong tower Jesus your name is a bulldozer Jesus to you belong all power Jesus whenever I call your name you make a way your name is a strong tower Jesus when we call on the name of Jesus he will come and make a way when we call on the name of Jesus every knee every knee has bowed your name, your name, your name is a strong tower Jesus to you belong all power Jesus whenever I call your name you made a way your name is a strong tower Jesus your name is a strong tower Jesus to you belong all power Jesus whenever I call you call you you make a way your name is a strong tower Jesus oh go go hallelujah to the Lamb to the Lamb oh go go hallelujah to the Lamb to the Lamb everybody say oh go 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 hallelujah to the Lamb to the Lamb Oh, go, go, hallelujah, to the land, to the land. I love the song. Hey, we won't stop praising you. We won't stop loving you forever and ever, forever and ever. We will stop praising you ha. we will stop loving you forever and ever forever oh we will stop we will stop praising you hey we will stop loving you forever and ever forever and ever we will stop praising you we will stop loving you forever and never and never 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 forever forever never forever oh we won't stop we will stop praising you jesus we will stop loving you forever and ever forever and ever we will stop praising you we will stop loving you forever and ever forever and never we will stop praising you we will stop loving you forever and ever Never and never, oh go, go, hallelujah to the 
land to the land hey oh go 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 hallelujah to the land to the land lift him up say oh go oh go oh go hallelujah to the land to the land oh oh go 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 hallelujah to the land to the land one more time oh go 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 hallelujah to the land to the land Oh, go, go, hallelujah, to the land, to the land. Why don't you lift up your voice and worship him? Hey, I know, no, but I do, say, hey, I know, no, 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 We lift your name, we lift your name. Nobody like you, Jesus, ha. No one like you, Lord, no one like you, Lord. Oh, forever and never and never, forever and never and never and never, forever, forever and never. You'll be my God forever and never, forever and never. And never, forever, you be my God. The champion of the host above and captain of my destiny. <laughs> In you alone, I make my boast you reign alone as Lord of all the champion of the host above and captain of my destiny in you alone I make my boast Father you reign you reign alone as Lord of all you reign alone you reign alone as Lord oh, Father you reign you reign you reign you reign alone as Lord oh you reign, you reign, you reign, you reign, you reign alone as Lord. Let's begin to lift up our voices this morning. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Thank God this morning. He reigns, he reigns, he reigns in our lives. There is no other God to go to but to come to his God who reigns in our lives. He reign alone, he reign alone, Father. We thank you, we're grateful. We lift up your voice, Reka Badebos, the Bandi Belemalama, Reko Zababa, the Pande Belemo, the Breka Palima, Rapande Bos, the Bende Beleka Palian, the Baboza Pan. Father, we thank you this morning for another day in your presence. And Lord, we've come to give you all the glory because it's your doing. We thank you for the move of your hand in our lives. We thank you for God showing your countenance upon us. We thank you for the light of God upon our lives. 
that has given us the way of God. We know that we've come before the God who knows what to do for his children. Father, this morning we've come again to say thank you. Lord, this morning we've come to say we bless you, we give you praise. It is by your power that we stand here this morning. It is by your grace we are not consumed. Thank you for mercy that has sustained us. Thank you for mercy that has prevailed with us. Thank you for mercy that has seen us through our challenges. Father, we are grateful. We thank you. Somebody lift up your voice and pray in the spirit this morning. You reign alone, you reign alone, oh God. You reign alone, you reign alone. As the cause the belly of the belly, Rabba Baba the body bones the palika tap up on the bone. Rabba the break up the bones the belly the belly. Rabba Baba the bones the break up the belly and the bone. Rabba Baba the tap on the bones the belly the pan and the bones the break up the bone. Rabba Baba the bones the great pelian. Father, we thank you and we give you praise. Lord, we thank you and we give you glory. By your grace, we stay alive. By your mercy, we are not destroyed. We are not consumed, oh God. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you for your awesome power and work in us. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor and adoration. In Jesus' mighty name, we have worshiped. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to take our thanksgiving prayer. And I'm taking a scripture from the book of Psalms, Psalms 3. One and two, and I read the verse five. Lord, how they have increased who trouble me. Many are they who rise up against me. Many are they who say to me, there is no help for him in God, seller. But you, O oh Lord, are a shield for me. I didn't hear your amen. amen. But you, O oh Lord, are a shield for me. Amen. My glory and the one who lifts me, lift up my head. And the verse 5 says, I lay down and slept. I walk, I awoke. For the Lord sustained me. Amen. Amen. I lay down and slept. I awoke. For the Lord sustained me. How can you sleep when your enemies are all around you? How can you have the peace when all things are against you? But here David is saying, Lord, irrespective of all what is going on in my life I lay down and I slept in other words it is the doing of the Lord are you understanding see his enemies are coming after him especially his own home this is a situation where Absalom is coming after his father but David has been running and he prayed he said Lord even though my enemies have multiplied around me, wherever I go, I see them. But when I went to bed, you gave me sound sleep. You gave me sleep. He was under intense pressure. But sleep is a blessing. Amen. Waking up to see another day is a blessing. Amen. This is the doing of the Lord and we're going to pray and thank God. See, so sometimes people wonder how you
see another day. They know you are not supposed to see another day. Even you yourself, you know that what I'm going through, I'm not supposed to see another day. But you see, grace it will come through. And mercy will also intervene. That is the doing of the Lord. Hallelujah. And so we're going before the Lord and say, Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for peace of mind and quietness of soul and renewing me by your spirit every day. Amen. It is the Lord that renews us by his spirit every day. The mercies of the Lord are renewed, what? Every day. Every day. It is God. So you say after me, Father, 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 in the name name of Jesus, Jesus. thank you you. for peace of mind mind and quietness quietness of soul soul. and renewing me by your spirit spirit. every morning. Lift up your voice and thank God. Lift up your voice and thank God for peace of mind and quietness of soul. If the Lord doesn't give you peace, you cannot go through the day his activities. If your soul is not calmed, you cannot go through it. But the mercies of the Lord are renewed every day. It is renewed every day. It is renewed every day. Father, I thank you for peace of mind and quietness of soul and renewing me by your spirit every day. Somebody lift up your voice, lift up your voice, thank God, thank God for peace of mind, for peace of mind. You're going out, he takes you, you're coming in, he takes you. He breaks you, he gives you peace of mind, he gives you peace of mind and quietness of soul to see another day, to experience another opportunity. It is the doing of the Lord. So, Father, we bless you. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we bless you. We give you praise. We exalt you. We magnify your holy name. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus, mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ezekiel 34. Ezekiel 34, 28. And there shall no longer be a prey for the nations, nor shall beasts of the land devour them. But they shall dwell in safety, and no one shall make them afraid. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let me read it again. And they shall no longer be a prey for the nations, nor shall beasts of the land devour them. You will not be devoured, but they shall dwell in safety, and no one shall make them afraid. No one shall make them afraid. This is God's word to you. This is God's promise to you. No one shall make you afraid. When God is with you, fear has nothing to do with you. See, every day in our lives, we are afraid of something. But when God is on your side, you will not be afraid. When God, see, four things I see in the scripture we read. He said, number one, he says, you shall not be a prey. See, a prey is when another animal uses another animal for food. You become a prey when a a, a stronger animal uses another animal for food. But God says, you will not not be a prey for the devil. You will not be a prey. And the second thing I see, he says, 
you shall not be devoured. See, you are too anointed for the enemy to devour you. Amen. You are too powerful in the law for the enemy to devour you. Amen. You will not be devoured in the name of Jesus. Amen. And the third promise, he says, you shall dwell in safety. The Lord will keep you safe. Amen. The Lord will protect you. Amen. God is our protection. And that is why when we're going out there, we are not afraid because we know who is on our side. Hallelujah. Amen. And then he says, you shall not be afraid. Fear is something that can cripple you. But God gives us an assurance that you shall not be afraid. Hallelujah. Yeah. For this is a prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, you are my shield and my protection. I will not be a prey. I will not be devoured. I will, not, I will dwell in safety and not be afraid because you are with me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When God is with you, you are not afraid of what the enemy Amen. can do against you. Say, my father, my father, my father, my father. in the name, in the name of, Jesus, of Jesus, you are, you are my shield my and, protection. and protection. I will not be afraid. I will not be afraid. I will I will not be afraid. I will not be a prey. I will not be devout. I will dwell in safety because you are with me. Lift up your voice and pray. You will not be a prey to the enemy. You will not be afraid. You will not be devout because God is on your side. Lift up your voice. It is God who takes you through. It is God who does it. It is God who sees us through our challenges. I will not be consumed. I will not be devoured because the Lord is with me. I am not afraid of the enemy. Thank you, O Lord, for being my protection. Thank you, O Lord, for being my shield. Thank you, O Lord, for being on my side. He said, I will be with you. I will not let you go. You will not be destroyed in the name of Jesus. I will protect you. I will hold you in my righteous right hand. Lord, we thank you. Lift up your voice and pray. Lift up your voice and pray. Lift up your voice and pray. The Lord is our shield. The Lord is our protection. He will not allow the enemy to be a prey on us. And he will not devour us. The enemy cannot devour in the name of Jesus. Lord, thank you for being my protection. Thank you for being my shield. Thank you for being there for my family. Thank you for being there for my family. My loved ones, in the name of Jesus, somebody keep praying. Somebody keep praying. Somebody keep praying. Somebody keep praying. In the name of Jesus, if the Lord has not been on our side, the enemy would have consumed us. If the Lord had not been on our side, the enemy would have destroyed us. Father, thank you for being there, oh Lord. Thank you for being our shoulder. Thank you for being our protection. We bless you. We give you praise. In Jesus mighty name we pray amen. amen Exodus chapter 4 and I'm reading from verse 11 and 12 to 12 so the Lord said to him who has made man's mouth or who makes the mute the deaf the seeing or the blind have not I the Lord? Now therefore, go a 
and I will be with your mouth and teach you what you shall say. Therefore, go. Go is a command. Go is an action word. He said, go. When you are afraid, you cannot go. But if you will stand on the word of God and take his word and you move, there shall be a performance in your life. Amen. He said, go. It is a month of soul winning. And Jesus told his disciples, go and win souls. God was talking to Moses. Moses was giving excuses. And God asked him, who created the mouth of God? Is it not I? In other words, God says, listen, I am the one who will speak through you. And so you must go. See, Moses was counting on his, on his own insufficiency. Instead of depending on the sufficiency of God. If you will depend on yourself, you can't do anything. But if you will depend on the sufficiency of God, God is able to do everything in the name of Jesus. Amen. All you have to do is obey the word and move. Is to obey the word and go. Hallelujah. 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 We are praying. It's a month of soul winning. We pray, Father, in the name of Jesus, teach me how to do the things you have called me to do. Amen. As you go out there, God himself is speaking to you. Yes. As we go out there, God himself is ministering through us Amen. to the people. Are you hearing me? Say, Father, 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 Father in, the in the name of Jesus, of Jesus, of Jesus, of Jesus. teach me, teach me how, to do how to do the things do. you've called me Father, to do. To do. See, we are all called. Yes. Everybody is called. Amen. Once you are in Christ Jesus, you are called. And we have to pray as such. Say, Father, Father in, the in the name of Jesus, of Jesus teach me teach how, to do, how to, do the to do the things you've called me to, to, do. to do. In the name, in the name of, Jesus. of Jesus, lift up your voice and pray. Lift up your voice and pray. May God teach us how to do the things he's called us to do. We are called to win souls. We are called to preach the word unto the lost. But the Lord will help us. The Lord will see us through. The Lord will see us through. In the name of Jesus. Father, teach us. Father, teach us the things you have called us to do. In all we do, we need your power. In all we do, we need your strength. In the name of Jesus. Teach me, oh God, teach me, oh God, teach me, oh God, how to do the things you've called me, you've called me to do in the name of Jesus. We are called to pick the word, we are called to pick the word, we are called to win souls, we are called to bring deliverance to the lost. Lord, this morning by your power, do it, oh God. Somebody lift up your voice and pray. Lift up your voice and pray. Pray, 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 pray. Rebel the belly the pump. As the bread upon the bow. The bread upon the end above. Rebel the belly the pump. The bow. May the Lord lead us. 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 Rebel the belly the pump. Father, we thank you, O Lord. We bless you and give you praise. We bless you and give you glory. Use us for your glory. Use us for your glory. In the name of Jesus, as we go, we go in the power of the Holy Spirit.
Christ. We go in the power of Christ in the mighty name of Jesus to win the laws for God. Lord, we bless you. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. 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 We're going to take one more prayer. Genesis chapter 50, verse 20. But as for you, you meant evil against me. But God meant it for good in order to bring it about as it is this day to save many people alive. But as for you, you meant evil against me. But God meant it for good. Amen. Amen. This is a personal prayer we're going to pray. They meant evil, but God meant it for good. Amen. They came with evil mind, but God turned the circumstances around in your favor. Amen. See, that is the mind of the enemy. See, they are with you, but in their minds, they are fighting against you. They see something good about you, but they will fight to bring it to an end. But because it is God who is working in you, whatsoever they do will not stand. Amen. Whatsoever they plan will not stand. Amen. Are you hearing? It is their mind to bring you down, but God will lift you up. Amen. This is what Joseph told his brothers. See, when the blessing of God is upon you, let them put you in a pit. The blessing will go with you. Amen. Let them try to destroy you. The blessing will go with you. Amen. He was put in a pit. The blessing followed him into the house of Potiphar. He was put in prison. The blessing followed him into the prison house. He was moved from prison to the palace. The blessing moved him to the palace. Wherever you are, wherever you go, wherever you find yourself, the blessing of God will pursue you. And whatever the enemy tries to do against you, it will never stand in the name of Jesus. Amen. They plan to bring you down, but God will keep you going Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. What is our prayer? Father, in the name of Jesus, anyone around me, the enemy is using to bring grief in my life, goes down in shame. Amen. They will go down in shame for your sake. Amen. Amen. They want to bring, they bring grief. You can't do anything. Your peace is taken. Your joy is taken. Everything is taken away. Say, they want, when you are in pain, that's where they, 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 they are happy. They always want to see you in pain. But this morning, I'm here to assure somebody that God is on your side. Amen. God is on your side. Amen. Amen. He that is in you is greater than he that is in the world. Amen. Your plan will not stand, but the word of God is sure and will stand. Amen. Say, Father, Father, my Father, my Father in, the in the name of Jesus, of Jesus. Anyone, anyone around me, around the, me. Enemy the enemy is using is to bring, to bring grief, grief in my life, life. goes down oh, no. in shame and disgrace in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and pray this prayer. They go down in shame. It is always people around us. It is always somebody close to us. It is always somebody who feeds us. But their plan is to see us down. Their plan is to see you cry. But God will put a laughter in our mouth. God will put a song in our mouth. God will give us testimony in the name of Jesus. Rabba Baba 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 Baba
Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Father, we thank you for answered prayer this morning. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus. And please have your seats. This morning, I give God all the praise and the glory. And I give honor to our Father, Pastor Dr. Kwabna Sapon and our mother, Pastor Mrs. Elizabeth Sapon, for this privilege to be here this morning to bring the church to you this morning. Hallelujah. And our online worshipers, the Lord bless you this morning and for waking up to be part of what is going on. God bless you and the Lord will see you through everything. Amen. We are still dealing with, we are in a season of soul winning, amen? Our season of soul winning. And this week, our father started with wisdom in winning souls for the kingdom. Wisdom in winning souls for the kingdom. Wisdom in winning souls for the kingdom. Proverbs 11 Verse 30, Proverbs 11, verse 30, and it reads, The fruit, the fruit of the righteous is the tree of life. And he who wins soul is wise. He who wins soul is wise. The fruit of the righteous, the righteous uses wisdom in winning souls. In Daniel 12, verse 3. Daniel 12, verse 3. Daniel 12, 3. Hallelujah. Those who are wise shall shine like the brightness of the firmament. And those who turn many to righteousness like the stars forever and ever. Those who are wise those who are wise shall shine like the brightness of the firmament and those who tend many. It takes wisdom to tend people to God or to Christ. It takes wisdom. And when you apply wisdom in, in, in how you do things, you are able to tend many unto Christ. Hallelujah. Let's see Matthew 10, 16. The book of Matthew, Matthew 10, 16. Matthew 10, verse 16. Behold, I send you out as sheep in the midst of wolves. Therefore, be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. I send you out. This is Jesus talking or telling his disciples. He says, Behold, I send you out a sheep in the midst of wolves. As you know, in the midst of wolves. Therefore, be wise as serpents and harmless as doves. You are like a sheep in the midst of wolves. Wolves don't easily allow praise to go, they will devour you. And Jesus uses uh, two uh, uh, characteristics of, of the, he used the characteristics of the serpent and the dove. See, the serpent is very wise, but very, very dangerous. The serpent is very subtle. He moves gently. He doesn't come out anyhow. He moves when people don't see him. See it. 
The dove is a very gentle bird. Very, very gentle and meek. And Jesus uses the characteristics of these two animals that this is how we are to be. That when we go into them, we will not be devout. We have to use the same characteristics into the world as we go to win souls for Christ. Wisdom. We have to apply wisdom. Amen. We apply wisdom. We are not there to judge anybody. We are not there to condemn anybody. But we are there to let them know what Christ has done in our lives. Amen. That is so winning. When you go out there in winning souls, it's not about anybody. It's about what Christ has done in your life that you want them to see. He has saved you from the hands of the enemy. He has redeemed you. And what he has done for you is what you go out there to let them know. Once upon a time, I was this. Once upon a, a time, I was that. But today, I'm a different person because Christ is in my life and I have come for you to know what Christ has done in my life. So your life becomes a reflective mirror to those who are in the world so they can see Christ in you and be able to follow you to Christ. Hallelujah. We become a reflection unto the world what Christ has done. And so our lives become a testimony unto them. Wisdom. How we speak. Let's see Colossians 5 and uh, Colossians 4. 5 and 6. Colossians 4. Work in wisdom towards those who are outside. This is, he says, work in wisdom towards those who are outside, redeeming the time. Let your speech always be with grace, seasoned with salt, that you may know how you ought to answer each one. That you may know. Let your speech always be with what? Grace. Seasoned with salt. So what comes out of our mouth is very, very important. We have to use wisdom to speak to those who are around us. Those who are in the same office with us. Those we meet across when we go out. Even in our homes. Our speeches should be with grace. And so how we speak tells a lot of what we do. So we must let our speech always be with grace. And our father yesterday gave two instances. He says, number one, he said, we must identify with the world. Uh, with them, those we want to win them to Christ, we must what? Identify with them. And he used a scripture in John 1.14. John 1.14. The book of John 1.14. Hallelujah. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we beheld his glory. The glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. And the word became what? Flesh. God is the word. God came down in the form of man. So he can identify with man to know how man is, to know how man feels, to know how we go about things. And so he also came in the form of man so he can identify with us and win us. Amen. And so the same way we apply wisdom when we go out there. We must identify with them as our father said. We must identify with them. Hallelujah. He became. So when Jesus walked on the face of this earth, he was a man. He was tempted in the same way. People tempted him. He encountered a lot. And he went on the cross and said, it is what? Finished. 
And the Bible says, he sits at the right hand of the Father making intercession for you. And because he knows what you are going through here on earth, that is why when the enemy brings a charge against you, he speaks to the Father and says, Father, I was there like him. I went through. I saw whatever he was going through. It is not easy. Give him another chance. Give him another opportunity. He intercedes for us. He has what? Identified with us. And so when we go out there, we must identify with the people and know how they feel. Wisdom. Amen. Number two, he said, we must communicate in their language. Maybe, you know, in the language, sometimes the way they talk, you have to talk the same way to get them. And the young ones probably are the ones, you know, I like the way Isaiah one time, you know, whenever we go out, you know, on, on evangelism, he, he is able to penetrate through the people the same way they do. Hey, yo, come, let's talk. But, you know, he behaves like them and he's able to speak in their language. That is how we are able to get them. We speak in their language. Amen. And this morning, I'm going to add one thing. Build bridges and make time for others. Build bridges. We must build bridges. We must, we must be able to connect with them. Build bridges and we must make time for them. Make time. Jesus Christ in the book of John chapter 4. We know the encounter he had with a woman who went to fetch water. Here is a situation where Jesus, the disciples had gone out there to get some food. But Jesus sat at the Jacob's well by the world. That well has been there by theologians over 1,800 years. And they were still fetching water there. But Jesus, when he got there, he sat down. Jesus knew that that was a place where people gather. That was a place where people come to fetch water. And so he sat there and he had an encounter with a woman who came to get water. He was very patient. He said, give me water to drink. The woman said, you are a Jew. I am a Samaritan. How can I give you water to drink? We are not the same. Jesus had a time. He connected. He was patient enough to talk to the woman. He said, if you know who is talking to you, I am the living water. If I give you this water, you will never test again. From there, the woman started connecting. She said, give me that water because I'm tired of coming here to fetch water. Jesus was able to connect with her. And through that connection, the woman was able to go back. Jesus warned her. She was able to go into the town to bring all the men. Can you imagine the Bible says she brought the men? The same people who were using her anyhow. She said, you have five, you've married five times already. Even the one you have, he is not your husband. Jesus used wisdom to deal with this woman. The woman felt free with Christ. She was able to go and bring the man back onto Jesus. Jesus won her. She now became a product. Now she was winning onto Christ. May the Lord give us wisdom that we can connect and bring people to the saving grace of God. May God use us as instrument of grace that will cause people to come to Christ Jesus in the name of Jesus. Wisdom. Amen. Wisdom. That well, Jacob's well, can be your office where people are. Jacob's well can be the marketplace where people are. He used that place as a platform because Jesus knew that people come there to fetch water and he was able to connect with the woman and connect to the people. May God use us as instrument of grace to connect with people unto his saving, unto salvation. Amen. Let's be on our feet this morning. Let's be on our feet. Hallelujah. And let's take one prayer.
Bible says wisdom is the principal thing. Therefore, we must get wisdom. We're going to pray this prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, I choose you to be my guide. Take me to where your power will lead me. Take me to where your power will lead me so we can connect, so we can connect using wisdom to bring people onto Christ. Say, Father, Father in the name, in the name of, Jesus, of Jesus, I choose, I choose you, you to, be to be my guide. My guide. Take me, take me, take me, take me. Where, where your power, your power leads, me. leads me. Let's pray. Let's pray. Pray that choose Christ. Choose him to be your guide. Choose him to be your guide. Where the power of God will lead you. Wherever God leads you, he is there with you. That God himself will do it. Father, we thank you. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. As you go, may the Lord go with you. Amen. As you go, may your office be the well of Jacob to get people. Amen. May God use what, whatever you find, wherever you find yourself, as a platform to get somebody onto Christ. Amen. May God give you the power to be able to speak unto others. May God see you Amen. going out, be blessed. You're coming and be blessed Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the blessings of God be with you. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 Let's share the grace together. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall remain blessed in the presence of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. And remember, Jesus is Lord. God bless you. Hallelujah. Please, we're going out this morning. As many that are free that can join us this morning for evangelism. We're leaving by 7.15. We're back by 8.15. Then this afternoon, if you can join us.